Hi Geek Aspirants, I'm Nishita and you're watching Geeks for Geeks, your one-stop solution for all coding related problems. And the countdown has officially begun. Only 90 days are left to Gate 2026. So if you've been waiting for a sign to buckle down, this is it. Today I'm going to give you a complete step-by-step 90-day -step roadmap so that you can crush all of your weak spots, maximize your preparation and walk into that exam with full confidence. So let's make every day count. First chunk of the days that we have is day 1 to day 7 where we'll talk about the mindset and planning. First things first, mindset is everything. The next 90 days are going to make or break your gate journey. So you need a step-by-step -step plan. Step one should be to analyze your current level. What's strong, what's weak, what's okay. Step two should be to set clear weekly and daily targets. What that means is you just don't need to aim to study a certain amount of hours. You need to solve a set of questions, complete certain topics and be done by it by the end of the day. And our last step would be here to build a time-blocked schedule. You need to reserve and allocate your peak energy hours for the tougher subjects. And you need to take the easy hours or the lighter hours for light revisions or solving MCQs. Now here you need to note that discipline will always beat motivation and a roadmap is a way of turning that discipline into results. So day 18 to day 45 is the chunk where we're going to talk about the core subject strategy. Data structures, algorithms, DBMS, OS, networking and many more. And the secret to this chunk is quality will always always matter far more than quantity. So what you need to do in this chunk is firstly revise smartly. Don't just go through your notes again and again. Solve the PYQs of gate. Then you need to pinpoint all of your weak areas where you keep on making mistakes again and again and then you need to revisit those mistakes weekly. And lastly, you need to use flashcards and mind maps as they're perfect for last minute retention. A pro tip here would be to dedicate two to three subjects per week. You need to rotate them, analyze them and solve daily practice questions. This is a very good tip to avoid burnout in any aspect. So in this chunk, we talk about having our mock tests and revisions and this covers day 46 to 75 of your preparation. By now, you would have completed your entire syllabus and you ideally should have. So the next step would ideally be to do mock tests and revise. The strategy is pretty simple. Take two to three mock tests every week and time yourself as if it's a real exam. Our next step would be after you've given these mocks, analyze every test. Don't just look at your score. See the mistakes that you've made and categorize it. Is it a conceptual error? Is it a calculation mistake? Was it a careless mistake? And after all of this, you devise strategically. You need to focus on the high weightage topics first. Don't try and do the topics you've already perfected. An idea here that you can do if you have the time is to maintain a test diary. You can track all of your scores, track your improvement and actually predict your gate scores based on the previous pattern. So our last chunk of preparation would be the last mile preparation, which is day 76 to 90. The last two weeks, you polish. You don't learn anything new. So this chunk is about quick revision. You go through your formula sheets, you go through your roadmaps, mind maps, and do high yielding revisions. Then you must emphasize even more on PYQs in this chunk. Solve at least two to three per week, no matter what. And the last point is to stay healthy. You must, must focus on your health. You must sleep, you must be hydrated, you must take breaks. All of these things are non-negotiables. And the reason you need to do this is a tired brain can never, never fight a sharp mind. So relax, rest and focus on your health. Our last segment is motivation and sign off. So to summarize what we've been through, you plan and analyze in week one. From week two to six, you focus on your course subject mastery. From six to 10, you focus on mock tests and revision. And 11 and 12 are your last mile preparation and confidence booster. 90 days may seem short, but with focus, practice and consistency, it's more than enough to crack whatever you want. Remember, it's never about how much you study, it's about how smart you study. If there is a will, there is a way. And if you want a written roadmap to all of this, you can go check out the Geeks for Geeks LinkedIn Gate page. It's specifically for Gate. You get all the Gate updates there. You get roadmaps for each and every subject and every update that you might need, you'll find it there. You also get practice questions. So don't forget to go and follow us there and keep up with all the questions. Happy learning, stay consistent and stay focused. Till the next time, I'll see you later.